And now we go down to deal once more with the Ravens. You ain't your friend, you know. Just chillin' as we go down into the dark abyss. Hmm. I wonder what the Japanese characters say. And now, do not take your rashings out, for they will freeze. At the same time, I don't even remember taking them out in the first place, so... Onwards we go through the freezer. Let's go. And presumably die. That is still terrifying. Though... You, uh, is it just me, or is it really weird how the boss with a minigun has so far been the easiest? Are you kidding me? Good thing I went back for all those. <laughs> They're just dots. Please don't play a cutscene. I want to go back. Okay, yeah. And now that we are here, and we have Bukus of Stinger Missiles... What the hell? There are so many... Why?! <laughs> this, this is... This is insane. I'm pretty sure that most of these are redundant. Like, I'm pretty sure, like, they can't shoot me now. Unless those ones over there are snipers. That's so weird. This place is... It's just like this game has suddenly went... And then there were buttloads of turrets. Why? Why must you make me suffer? Well, let's put on the so come and run, boys. Put on the... Th okay, there's no thermal stuff to worry about. Let's go. Metal Gear. Metal Gear! Remember when you threw grenades at it? You'd think this thing would be guarded to button back. Well, would you look at that? At least there's the butt. Okay, so I can go into the water for some reason. Or at least a watery area for a ration. My dear beloved ration. I'm going to actually call people now because we are here at fucking Metal Gear. Where are you now? Right in front of Metal Gear, but it's strange. What is? There's nobody here. No guards, nobody patrolling. It's too quiet. Maybe because they're all ready. They said they even input the PAL codes. What should I do? All we can do is use the override system that President Baker told you about. 
but I've only got one of the three keys. And besides that, like Ocelot said, there's some trick to using the keys. Leave it to me. You got some kind of plan? Well, I'm in the computer room right now. I'm trying to access Baker's private files. Baker's files? Don't you need a password? Of course, but there are ways. Are you a hacker? Yep, that describes me pretty well. Does it look like you can get in? I don't know yet. You I'll are literally the only I'm person that I can you. really trust right now. Snake, stop that launch. Head for the control room in the underground base. The control room is on the third floor of the underground base, isn't well, it? Well, let's save. There's no time. Save me. What can I do for you, sir? Everybody is evil and wants to kill me. <laughs> Snake, don't give up. Remember Macbeth, Act 5, Scene 3. I'll fight till from my bones my flesh be hacked. Give me my armor. Everyone is counting on you, Snake. You You've just love it. your quotes. Oh, more trap grenades. Are they going to throw more just bukus of death at me? All right, just stock me up. Stock me up on everything. This feels like an iconic moment. Time to climb. Ooh, is it time for an FMV? No, it just loaded. I don't like when my stuff is jammed. Why is it jammed up here, but not down there? Okay. I was like, I know they say, Snake, you've got to hurry. I was like, yeah, 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 whatever you say. I wonder if the re... Okay, who's calling? I called you last time. Snake, it's me again. How's it going? Uh, not bad. I just got past his third security level. He was a pretty careful guy. Do you think you'll break in soon? I never met a system I couldn't bust into. I like how okay. it's kind of gone from, uh... Snake having this huge team to just having Otacon, but... I wonder if the reason why they have to load separate places is because they put so much detail into Metal Gear. But it's just like, whenever it loads, like, or even there with the... This feels like it should be a door. Give me my scope. I see movement. I killed you, asshole. I'm gonna go ahead and put on body armor for the run. Of course now there's a guard. Is he making his way here? I can't honestly tell. Oh yeah, and the clanking will alert them to my presence. I don't even know if I could snipe him. Or if I'd want to. Zoom. Okay, where do I go from here? Is there a vent? Um, I am currently lost. What do I have that could help me here? I honestly don't know where to go or what to do right now. 
maybe I could go a different way. Yeah, I could probably go right, couldn't I? Let's go. No, I couldn't. This is the only way I could go. Right? Oh, there's an extra ladder. I'm dumb. But at least it, I was able to see, like, okay, lots of stuff. Lots of evil stuff. I'm on top of Metal Gear. Snake, I did it. You got past security? Bingo. Great. So what do you got? I accessed the confidential Metal Gear file. So what about the PAL override system that Baker talked about? I haven't found it yet. That's what I need to know. But Snake, I found something else. What? The secret behind the new nuclear weapon. Just as I thought, the nuclear wow. weapon is designed to be fired from the railgun like a projectile. It doesn't use fuel, so it isn't considered a missile. That way it can get around all sorts of international treaties. Pretty sneaky. Yes, but effective. And that's not even the scariest yeah. thing about this weapon. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. It's a stealth weapon. <laughs> you mean it won't show up on radar? Yeah. The truth is, they've been working on a stealth missile since the late 70s. Why weren't they able to develop one until now? Because of the missile rocket propulsion system. It would be picked up by enemy satellites. Oh yeah, that makes sense. But unlike a missile, the railgun doesn't burn any propellant, so it can't be detected by any current ballistic missile detection systems. An invisible nuclear warhead. Totally impossible to intercept. And on top of that, it's got a surface-piercing warhead designed to penetrate hardened underground bases. Yeah, we learned that lesson in the Gulf War. This thing could mean the end of the world. It's the ultimate weapon. And from a political point of view, it avoids the problem of nuclear reduction and nuclear inspections. Colonel, is this true? Are you listening? I'm listening. If word of this got out, it could delay the signing of the START III treaty and cause a huge international incident. Yeah, it would be nasty. The United States would be denounced by the UN. It could even bring the president down. Did you know this, Colonel? I'm sorry. You changed, Colonel. I won't make any excuses. Snake, listen to me. This new nuclear weapon, it's never actually been tested, only simulated. You mean they ran a computer model? Yeah, that's why they were conducting this exercise. They needed to get actual experimental data to back up the simulation. What were the results of the exercise? It looks like it went better than they hoped for. Huh. I can't find the data anywhere on this network. The disk. I think the data as important as that would be carefully recorded. It was. President Baker gave me an optical disk with all of the test data. What? Now they, they have the practical have data to no. shoot the thing. Ocelot took it from me. Damn. The terrorists have replaced the dummy warhead with a real warhead. Once they input the detonation codes, they should be ready to launch. So you think they can do it? Well, the dummy warhead was designed to be identical to the real thing, so I think so. Did you find out how to override it yet? Not yet. It must be in a separate file. Right now I'm looking through all of Baker's personal files. We're Let me take a look around. You. Okay, I can get over to the other side. Which means I gotta deal with a guard. And this rickety stuff. I could try and, uh, no, I can't. Okay, this will give me the perfect view to stealth onto him and shoot him in the back. Because I want to kill the guy. I mean, I could try and stealth past him, but I want to explore. I want full reign of this place. Not the best idea, considering things. Actually, let me call some people. Yo, Natasha, what do you think of this? Can we even tell her about it? I don't need to know about my SOCOM. Anything else? The nuclear warhead of evil. As long as the strategy of nuclear deterrence continues, Nuclear weapons may yeah, be yeah. reduced, but they will never be eliminated. 
Yeah, that would have been a long one, but it's just like not 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 pertinent to my interest right now. Snake, isn't the detonation code input system in the control room? All right. Hurry up and get in there. Where the hell did the guard go? Where the hell did he go? Uh, there you are. He has a long patrol path. I like the music that's playing, though. Like the little tinkly, tinkly music. Zoom. Yeah, those little down paths are kind of the reason why I want to kill this guy. Plus all the rickety rick rick stuff. Kinda wish that I it had a different perspective. Alright, he's so far away. Call, call, what do you got for me? Snake! Did you find it? No, I haven't found out about the override system yet, but I found Baker's ulterior motive. He's just looking to get rich, isn't he? Well, that's part of it. Armstech is in much worse financial trouble than I thought. I know they lost their bid to make the next generation fighter jet. That plus the reduction in SDI spending. It looks like there was even some talk of a hostile takeover. Everything was riding on this project, I guess. And it looks like we were paying a lot of bribe money to the DARPA chief. Bribe money, huh? Yeah, and Baker was a big proponent of the nuclear deterrent theory. I see. So anyway, what about the override? Just give me a little bit longer. Dang it. I want to turn around. Okay, the guy has a long patrol path. Didn't want to alert him. Went into an FMV. I fled him straight into an FMV. Okay, I've entered the PAL codes and disengaged the safety device. We can launch any time. There's still no response from Washington. It looks like we'll have to show them that we mean business. Should I set it for Chernerton, Russia? No. There's been a change. The new target is Lopnor, China. Why, boss? I'm sure neither you nor Mr. Golukovich would really like to see a nuclear bomb dropped on your motherland, right? What? Liquid. Oh, yeah, because Liquid was supposed There's to be dead. Nothing there. But wrong. I kind of come to terms with him being alive by now. Nuclear test site. If we nuke a major population center, the game's over. But a nuclear explosion at a test site can still be concealed from the public. Meanwhile, Washington will be worried about the retaliatory strike from China. That'll probably mean top secret talks between both countries' leaders. Of course. And in the process, the president will be forced to divulge the existence of a new and highly destabilizing nuclear weapon to the Chinese. What do you think that will do to the U.S.'s reputation? Or the President's? And with the CTBT, that means that China and India... I see... Yes. When the other countries hear about this new weapon, they'll all want to contact us. Washington won't be very happy when we start selling their own system to the highest bidders. Yes. The President will break. He will give in to our demands. Big boss's DNA. One billion dollars isn't that dollars. much anymore. That money will be used to cure our genome soldiers as well. I'm also including the Fox Dye vaccine in our demands. Fox Dye. It killed Octopus and the Armstech president. So it's true that it affects older people first. Mantis might not have been affected because he wore a mask. Wolf wasn't infected either. Perhaps due to those tranquilizers she always took. Something to do with the adrenaline level in the blood. 
Or maybe it's just because this fox die was still experimental, and they haven't worked out all the bugs yet. In any case, have you heard from your friend, Colonel Sergei Golukovich, at the Spetsnaz? He still has doubts about the ability of Metal Gear. He said we can talk after Metal Gear's test launch is successful. Hmm, he's a very prudent man. There's nothing to worry about. The Colonel wants Metal Gear and a new nuclear weapon so bad he can taste it. If Russia wants to regain its position as a military superpower, they need to reinforce their nuclear arsenal. They need a nuclear weapon that can't be intercepted. Metal Gear will allow them to gain first strike capability over the rest of the world. Their regular army is in shambles, and they think they can restore their country's military power with nuclear weapons? Galukovich, <laughs> he's no warrior, he's a politician. But he's the one who gave us the hind and most of our other heavy firepower. He's got over a thousand soldiers under his command. If we join forces, we could put up quite a resistance here. Since Mantis died, the genome soldiers' brainwashing has started to wear off. I'm worried about the men's morale. They were brainwashing their own soldiers? With the Russians would boost that as well. What do you say? We're not going anywhere. We're going to dig in here. We could still escape. We've got the most powerful weapon ever made, and we're about to ally with Galukovich's forces. Are you going to fight the whole world? <laughs> What's wrong with that? We can launch a nuclear warhead at any target on this planet. A nuclear warhead, invisible to radar. And on top of that, this base is full of spare nuclear warheads. Once we get the DNA and the money, the world will be ours. What about your promise to Colonel Golukovich? I have no interest in the revival of Mother Russia. You're not thinking of reviving Big Boss's dream. From today, call this place a stinger. Outer heaven. Big Boss's dream. But boss, you're not worried about the PAL being overridden. If the code is in it again, it'll be deactivated. They know! No need to worry. The DARPA chief and the arms tech president are both dead. Does Snake know how the override system works? You interrogated <laughs> him, don't you know? He didn't have any keys on him. Good. Then no one can stop Metal Gear now. By the way... What should we do with that wound? I think maybe uh, Revolver Ocelot's gonna turn on a liquid She's because he doesn't want to revive Mother kids. Russia. <laughs> we'll keep her as our ace in the hole. Yay! Meryl. I'm not a failure. <laughs> We're in Brex Position City! Snake, I found Baker's top secret files. Great job. How's it going there? They've finished inputting the PAL codes. So, how do we deactivate them? Okay, you see the override system that the president was talking about? It can also be used to input the detonation codes. You see, if you insert the keys when the warhead is active, you deactivate it. And if you insert them when it's inactive, it becomes That seems like activated. a weird system. And you can only use the keys once. Only once, huh? Yeah, you better get started. We don't have much time. But it takes three keys, right? I've only got one of them. Hold on a minute. You see, that's the Let me trick. guess, there are key numbers on one key card? Keys. What are you talking about? Oh. The card key is made of a shape memory alloy. Shape memory alloy? Yes. It's a material that changes shape at different temperatures. The key is made out of it. This card key? Yeah. The card key changes shape at different temperatures. So this key the music's is gone. actually three keys in one. Clever. Can you see the input terminals in the center of the control room? I see them. Those three laptop terminals are for the emergency input. There should be a symbol on each screen. Each symbol corresponds to a different key. Input the keys in order from left to right. The left one's for the room temperature key. See the symbol? Next to that goes How do I the change low the temperature temperatures? Key. The one on the right is the high temperature key. Okay, I got it. First, I change the shape of the card, and then I input them in order, right? That's right. All you do is insert the card keys. After you insert the key into the module, a hard disk reads the information contained on it. 
Once you've finished with all three terminals, the code input process is complete. But here's the thing. You can only use the key three times. It's they an know. emergency system. It's only meant to be used once. The world is riding on that key, Snake. Who's that? Damn. No. God Keep damn it. Drain it dead. Snake, this is bulletproof glass. There's no way in. I'll enjoy watching you. Now I have to die. go all the way down to the drainage ditch, unless you want to jump to make it easier for me. Snake, you've oh got boy. to get that key. Action scene. Son of a bitch. Ow! Asshole. Okay. Probably want to invest in stun grenades. I didn't see anybody. But damn, that Geno soldier is on my ass. Oh, he doesn't know how to get up here. Wait a minute. Did it suddenly change from... Oh, no, there it is. Huh. Just a small room scan to make sure. But yeah, they knew I was there the entire stinking time. But now what? It's gonna be a bit of a pain to change the temperature of the card and input it three times. Did the stinking turret respawn? It did. Luckily, I have a stinger for your never better better boom. Guess let's put on thermal, maybe. Dang it, dang it, dang it. So I think I may have started off at the wrong place. I got another Ashen. It said it fell in the drainage ditch. Where the hell? Also, why is the water hurting me? Is it radioactive I really have no idea Oh maybe no thermal There it is. No, that's another Russian. I got a bomb. <laughs> okay. That kills me. Now let me take a look at the key, the PAL key. Okay, so it's in the sea. Usage. But now what? I have to get all the way back up. And punch in the override. Before having a good old punch out with my brother. If all the words that are to be believed... But apparently, oh, my bad. Get up, get up. Yo, stop turning around.
Yeah, but this time I should really just run up to him and shoot him because it seems like they only have one guard. Wrong one. Dang it. And I think the door's back open for some reason. Okay, he's coming back. Yeah, they're gone. But this will allow me to appear in ish. <laughs> I guess that's how you get onto Metal Gear a different way. We need multiple ways into Metal Gear. Another stinking cutscene? I just got back! Okay, obviously that, and then we want to throw a chaff grenade. And then I guess... Screw it. We're stinging these... Stinging these bitches. Alright, now I can only use it once. But I don't know how to change the stinking temperature. That's the downside. Let me see. Well, really, gosh dang diddly first, I'm going to talk to everyone and save. Yo, Otacon, what do you gotta say? You found the card key, right? First comes the Then I need cold key. and then hot. Put it into the far left terminal in the control room. That key is actually an IC card. Its connector pins and main body are made of a shape memory alloy. It's designed so that unless it's been changed to the correct shape, it won't be recognized by the PAL code input terminal in the control room. And the detonation code. Yeah, but how do I change it? Master, what do you guys say? You got the card key back? You're helpful. Hurry Does anybody actually have any way of changing the code? You're Say, all so helpful. Put the PAL codes. Save me, so if I die, I can come what back can to I life and do this all over again. Wohi-san is toil and trouble. Honor, but an empty bubble. What about you, Snake? All right, so the room temperature too? key is simple. Let me just get the PAL card. change it to cold now pal number two freeze do they the have a freezer in here or do I have to go back to the water oh um ah I guess I destroyed everything so hopefully the guy doesn't respawn so I guess this is going to be a lot of running back and forth. A lot of running back and forth. Because... Ow, I was grabbing you, asshole. Grab him! I'm pressing the fucking button. Yeah. 
You know what, for that asshole, die. But yeah, now I get it, I think. What we gotta do is take the code, uh, the card key to the frozen place and take it out. And then when it, we take it out in the frozen place, it'll warp to be the uh, cold key card. And then after we put it in back here, we have to run all the way back to the smelting place and take it out like we did with the rashings, and it should undo it all. And I can... Gosh, diddly dang. Yeah. But yeah. You thought this is the climax? No. This is the slow max. We have to run back and forth all over the place. Probably through that. Does that mean we have to go through the room of electronic hell? I think it does. Hello, and welcome to the room of electronic hell, but we have enough stinger missiles that it doesn't really matter. That's essentially it. Those are the only ones I think I need to destroy. How'd you not see me, asshole? These all confuse me, so... I'm shooting you just to be safe, and then I'm shooting the other ones just to be safe, because I have enough stinger missiles to do it! I am rich in ammunition! Okay, I apologize for mocking you, slightly. I guess we just have to wander around in Mr. Frozen place, wait for it to change. Let's call Otacon, see what he has to say. Where should I do that? This is Alaska. Go outside. It's cold everywhere. Yeah, that's what I'm doing right but now. You're close to the warehouse where you fought Raven, right? That place is right in the middle of the permafrost layer. I just hope that there isn't no like a... So do I just wait in here long enough or what? I swear, if my rations freeze before this thing friggin' works, I'm gonna get a little angry. Also, all these missiles are only just to find my stuff. Because, I mean, this is a freezer, right? Or, yeah, there's freezer stuff. Freeze, damn it! If I crawl along. How long does it take for this key to freeze? Hot damn. There we go. Now we're just going to make our way before it thaws. Okay, so put back on our normal key card. And we will nuke all the wall turrets that miraculously respawn. That's gonna hurt me. Oh, it didn't. Yay. Yeah, you. Uh, 
Okay, so the first part entering, you really do need just chaff grenades. Because those, there's no way you can get to a good position to shoot those. And besides, you need to work it so that it doesn't heat up enough. But still, I want to know where Ocelot and uh, Liquid went. They're just like, this place has bulletproof glass. You can't get in. And now we're going to fuck off. You can't find a snake. We're just going to monologue in front of you about our evil plans, even though we know that you're here. At the very least, they shot at me before they left, proving to me they're still the villains. Climb the freaking ladder. Climb the ladder, snake! It is the only way to win the honor! And put the soak on, because it doesn't matter if we attract this dude, he's the only one here. Nothing, I'm entering a new area that you don't exist even though it's just stairs. Alright, well, first things first, let me check the palkey. Still hot, well, not hot, still cold. Time to sting! I should probably also... Wait, I don't need to. I could just, uh, blind spot run. And now... Okay, no, 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 we don't want to... <laughs> Accidentally put it in the wrong one, even though there are probably security stuff for this. Pow, 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 That's two of three. Now for even the longer backtracking. Warm it up in the place that's Warm far, it. far away. Eh, fuck it. I probably shouldn't worry about those cameras because it's in a singular area. And, I mean, they already know that I'm here, so who cares, really? But, whoa. Okay, it was red, and for some reason it was like, Red! Red means heat! Arr! I am losing my mind while playing this game. Don't you get up. Hopefully he doesn't respawn. Be That'd be weird. They, they have a one-person limit? <laughs> that amuses me, actually. Sir, Snake came and killed one person. Send out one more man. Well, we could swarm him like we did at the command tower. One more man, that's all we need. Alright, so yeah, now we gotta make our way back to the stinking smelting cave with those super long elevators. I'm gonna jump cut, because it's easier for me. And plus, it doesn't waste your time, because... This is going to be long. Ow! How dare you! Well, I mean...
though this is probably the quick little what the hell Root City bum 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 They added patrol patterns to the freezers That's rude Now head back up I probably should have saved because who knows maybe this is gonna be another battle royale Probably not but still you never know this game's crazy What you got for me, Kern? Oh, Master. Snake, it's about Naomi Hunter. Then you should talk to the Colonel. He's looking into it. Turn your monitor off. Okay, it's off. No one else can hear us. Go ahead. Sorry, but I didn't want the Colonel to hear. Okay, so what's up? I've got a good friend in the Pentagon. Yeah? He's the one who told me about it. It looks like the DIA recently developed a new type of assassination weapon. An assassination weapon? Snake, have you ever heard of something <laughs> called Fox Dye? No. Fox Dye. Liquid and the others were talking about it. Yeah. It's some kind of virus that, that targets specific people. I don't know all the details, but... What are you trying to say? It's too similar. What is? The cause of death. Didn't the arms tech president and the DARPA chief, I mean, decoy octopus, oh, die of something that looked like a heart attack? Yeah. Well, apparently, Fox Die kills its victims by simulating a heart attack. No. You're telling me that Naomi was behind it? Snake, try to remember. Did Naomi give you some kind of injection? The nanomachines. She was in the best position to have done it, but I don't know what her motive was. Does the Colonel know? I'm not sure. But he still hasn't questioned her. Okay, I'll ask him myself. Colonel, what's new with the Naomi situation? I just placed Naomi under arrest. Arrest? She was sending coded messages towards the Alaskan base. I didn't want to believe it. But she must be working with the terrorists. Are you sure? I'm afraid so. She's being interrogated now. What kind of interrogation? Well, I'd like to avoid the rough stuff, but we don't even have any sodium pentothal here. Call me if you find out anything. So it's true. There goes the strip church. Naomi, I can't believe it. That means the Fox Dye vaccine must be around somewhere. Listen, I've got bigger things to worry about. But Snake. You might be infected too, you know. All I can do. Is <laughs> well, joyous day. Things just keep on rolling and rolling and rolling. And before we go any further, I'm gonna frickin' save. <laughs> the moment I land, the turret shoots. Oh, that's gold. Save me from the auto-locking turret. What is it, Snake? Ooh. Snake, come what come may. Time and the hour runs through the roughest day. We're almost out of time, Snake. I know, that's Please why I'm running me. to a place to heat up a key card. You can't just like, you're the only one. I know, I am the only one. I'm the only one that can save the day. Because everyone else is either incompetent, got shot and killed, was a decoy, is evil, or is simply just not the player character. Hell, I would take Raiden right now. Or Raiden, whatever. Like, I mean, like, 
the metal, the normal Metal Gear Solid series raid, and not uh, Revengeance or Rising Revengeance. I forget. Now I have to run, heat up the key card, have some fun. Good. There's nothing there. There we go. The guy will probably be around, but I'll only kill him if he comes onto the my platform. <laughs> There's an edge. Ow, the edge. Damn it. That's kind of funny. It's like, a rashing. Snake died trying to get a rashing. The world ended because Snake tried to get food. Feed me, Seymour. I'll just put the pal key card on. Ooh. It turned back to normal in the time it took me to get here. I don't like that omen. I'm just standing here, shadow boxing, beside a place that can literally kill me. I probably should have placed a claymore there. You know, while I'm at it, I shall place a claymore right here for any daring visitors who dare to try and annoy me. And now to play the waiting game. Snake does a jig while waiting for a key card to heat up. Weird. How. Oh! If you crouch and are crawling, it shows the places you can get into. Weird. All right. Now we got to book it all the way back. All the way back. No stopping, because we don't want this thing to cool off. No stopping, just running, because if this thing cools off, I'm gonna have to go back here again. Which is annoying. And this isn't like... An and, like, because I don't want the footage to get corrupted, I can't just go, okay, reset the uh, sim emulation. Because that means going back to the home page of PS3 and then starting it up again. And PlayStation 3 hates playing by those rules. By that, I mean, for whatever reason, if you start recording on the PlayStation 3 home screen and change it to uh, a PlayStation... Assholian. Fuck off. Why is that there? To annoy the player. To simulate your stences. Or whatever. But yeah. What was I on about? Oh yeah. Yeah, whenever, like, you try and start a game from the PlayStation home screen while uh, recording, it just does not like it. It goes, no, no, and the footage just breaks, at least for the Hopog. Not sure if, like, Elgato would work better. But th the weird thing is, it's only the PlayStation 3. The Nintendo Switch doesn't do it. The PlayStation 4 doesn't do it. Just the 3. Haven't tried any other consoles. Oh, boy. Snake, can you hear me? What the hell? It's Naomi. Naomi? What the hell? No, you're not. The others are busy right now. I'm on a different codec. Naomi, is what the colonel says true? Yes, but not everything I said was a lie. Who are you? I don't know myself. I don't know my real name or even what my parents looked like. I bought all my identification. 
But my reason for getting into genetics was true. Because you want to know yourself, right? That's right. I want to know where I came from, my, my age, Why my don't race, you know anything. yourself? Naomi. I was found in Rhodesia sometime in the 80s. A dirty little orphan. Rhodesia? What's now known as Zimbabwe? Yes. Rhodesia was owned by England until 1965, and there were lots of Indian laborers around. That's probably where I got my skin color from, but I'm not even sure about that. Naomi, you're too worried about the past. Isn't it enough to understand who you are now? Understand who I am now? Why should I? No one else tries to understand me. I was alone for so long, until I met my big brother, and him. Your big brother? Yes. Frank Yeager. What? He was a young soldier when he picked me up near the Zambezi River. I was half dead from starvation and he shared his rations with me. Yes. Frank Yeager. The man who you destroyed was my brother and my only family. No. Gray Fox? We survived that hell together, Frank and I. He protected me. He's my one connection. The only connection I have to my past. And he brought you back to America? No. Big Boss? I was in Mozambique when he came. Who is he? You mean Big Boss? Yes. He brought us to this land of freedom. This America. And then he and my brother went back to Africa to continue the war. Snake. And that's when it happened. You killed my benefactor and sent my brother home a cripple. I vowed revenge and joined Foxhound. I knew it was my best chance to meet you and I prayed for the day that I would. So, were your prayers answered? Yes. I waited two long years. To kill me? Is that all you cared about? Yes. That's right. Two years. You were all I thought about for two long years. Like some kind of twisted obsession. Do you still hate me? Not exactly. I was partly wrong about you. What about Liquid and the others? <laughs> I'll have my revenge on them too. Naomi, you didn't kill that doctor too, did you? The one that used Gray Fox for his genome experiments? Dr. Clark? No. That was my brother. Afterwards, I covered it up and helped him hide out. So that ninja... I mean, Gray Fox... He's come here to kill me? I don't think so. I think he just came here to fight you. I wasn't sure before, but now I think I understand. A final battle with you. That's all he lives for. I'm sure of it. Fox... No. Naomi, tell me something. About fox dye? Fox dye is a type of retrovirus that targets and kills only specific people. First, it infects the macrophages in the victim's body. Fox dye contains smart enzymes created through protein engineering. They're programmed to respond to specific genetic patterns in the cells. Those enzymes recognize the target's DNA? Right. They respond by becoming active and using the macrophages, they begin creating TNF Epsilon. Uh huh? It's a type of cytokine, a peptide which causes cells to die. The TNF Epsilon is carried along the bloodstream to the heart, Devious. where they attach to the TNF receptors in the heart cells. And then, they cause a heart attack? The heart cells suffer a shock and undergo an extreme apoptosis. Then, the victim dies. Apoptosis? You mean the heart cells commit suicide? Naomi. What? You must have programmed that thing to kill me too, right? Do I still have time? Naomi. I don't blame you for wanting me dead, but I can't go yet. I still have a job to do. Listen, Snake. I'm not the one who made the decision to use Fox Dye. Huh? You weren't? No. 
Wow, it just keeps going deeper. I just wanted to let you know that. No, that's not the whole truth. Uh -huh. The real thing I wanted to tell you was... Snake, I... I... Hey, what are you doing? <gasps> Snake, I can't allow Naomi to make any more unauthorized transmissions. <laughs> what? Naomi's been removed from this operation. What happened to Naomi? What did she mean when she said that Fox Die was a part of this operation? Colonel, let me talk to her. I won't. She's under arrest. Colonel, you double-crossed me. Snake, there's no time for that. Right now, your job Snake, is Snake, you can literally just Metal say, Gear. let me talk to okay, her or Snake. I won't stop Metal Gear. <laughs> You're just like, I'm the only one that can stop this. If I don't get what I want right now, Colonel, I'll just let it happen. Yeah, but now we gotta run and run fast. Because this freaking key, I don't want it to cool. I just need to make it to the door. Just make it to the door. Yes! Not even that weird. You'd think they would put guards in the quickest way. Okay, now just throw a chaff grenade now. Come on, 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 go. Yes! This is definitely one of those games where you need to maneuver the clunk. And, like, if you do that, it's wonderful. So, it's just that you have to be prepared and understand the worst aspects of this game that generally come from poor decisions of design and age. Makes me wonder how good the, um, the remake on the GameCube is. I'll have to look into getting that. Just in case. Give, fuck. Give me chapter names. But, yeah. Though I do know that, uh, like, uh, Kadikaris, who is a big PlayStation fan, loves Metal Gear, doesn't actually like the uh, GameCube version remake. Because they just changed so much, and the voices... Even though the voices sound like I, uh, like, expect them to after playing, like, Super Smash Bros. It's just like, but that's what they always sound like, isn't it? Apparently no. Because, like, they're definitely keeping it more mellow here. In terms of voice acting. Fuck you. I just want to get in there. Fuck you. Soldier dude. He's merely an annoyance. Put it in. Yes! Yes! My suffering ends! Okay, what's the twist? There has to be a twist. Lol. <laughs> Knew there was a twist! No! Thank you. Snake. I knew you were too trustworthy. Now the detonation code is completed. Nothing can stop Metal Gear now. Master, what's going on? You found the key, and even activated the warhead for us, too. I really must express my gratitude. Sorry At to least you admit that was silly. Silly shape memory alloy business. What are you talking about? We weren't able to learn the DARPA chief's code. Even with Mantis' psychic powers, he couldn't read his mind. That's then what that Oswald thing was. Mm. Accidentally killed him during the interrogation. In other words, we weren't able to launch the nuclear device, and we were all getting a little worried. Without the threat of a nuclear strike, our demands would never be met. What do you mean? Without the detonation codes, we had to find some other way. That's when we decided you 
Might prove useful, Snake. What? First, I thought we might get the information from you, Snake. So I had Decoy Octopus disguise himself as the DARPA chief. Unfortunately, Octopus didn't survive the, the encounter, thanks to Fox Die. You mean you had this plan from the beginning, just to get me to input the detonation code? Huh? So this is a real you shaggy didn't think dog story, ain't it? Far by yourself, did you? Who the hell are you? In any case, the launch preparations are complete. Once the world glimpses the power of this weapon, the White House will have no choice but to surrender the Fox Dye vaccine to me. Their ace in the hole is useless now. Ace in the hole? The Pentagon's plan to use you was already successful in the torture room. <laughs> Snake, you're the only one who doesn't know. Miscommunication uh, kills everybody. Who are you anyway? I'll tell you everything. Where you are you, asshole? If you come where I am, that is. Where are you? Very close by. Snake, that's not Master Miller. Campbell, you're too late. Master Miller's body was just discovered at his home. He's been dead for at least three days. I didn't know because my codec link with Master was cut off. But Mei Ling said well, that still his transmission doesn't, uh, signal was coming who's deep from throat inside is. the base. So who is it? Snake, you've been talking God to... God damn it. Me, dear brother. Surprising how effective sunglasses and hair can be. Liquid, how the... You've served your purpose. You may die now. Well, joke's on you, I have a gas mask. Well, I guess first things first, blow out those cameras. Okay, but now I need to find a way out. Won't level card work? Nope. God diddly damn it. Where do I go? I know, I'll talk to people. That's how you live. I can hold I'll on try. for a bit. Just hold on for a minute. Yo, Deep Throat, would be really nice if you could call. Oh, God damn it. How about you? Want to talk while I die? Uh, figures. Yo, Campbell, what do you have to say? You backstabbing bastard. Snake, Emerus will be trust able him to more than you. Just trust him and hang on. But while he's opening it, I'm gonna try and blow open the door. Blow this open. Thank you, that is quick work. Snake, 